What's up everybody? Welcome back to my LEGO Star Wars Let's Play. Today so we'll be getting the mini kits for episode 1, chapter 6, Darth Maul. Let's get right into it. So I already took care of this first step. After you do that, you're gonna want to come over here. Fix up this uh, ship so it starts to float. Switch to a high jumping character. Oh. Pop up up here and you'll see it right there. All right, for this next one, you're going to run across the room onto this other one, and it's going to be floating above it, too. All right, after that, you're going to want to jump up on these little things. Oh, I totally just missed that. And your teammate should go over to the other one. There we go. Yeah, he's one to switch first. Lift each other up, hop up here, and then switch to R2 and use this switch. And then once we head through here, I'm going to take care of these guys real quick. All right. Finally cleared out those enemies. There were like probably three wa waves of them. Uh, once you're done with that, you're just going to want to run over these little lights. And then your teammate should get the other side. And once those are lit up, it'll appear right here in the middle. All right. For the fourth mini kit, it'll take place in this room, which is the second room. All you're going to want to do is make your way to the top of this like whole platform thing. I take in this grip or grapple hook. I don't even know what I was trying to say. There. And then take a double jump character and get up here. Also has a bunch of uh, blue coins and stuff. So if you're still going for the true Jedi, this is a good place to go for it. And then as you can see, there's one up here. I just want to use the force on this to lift this up as high as it'll go. I actually did these in the wrong order. There's a better one to go for first. And there's that. All right. Once you get that one, the reason I say there's a better one to go for is because it's on the very bottom floor. You just go all the way to the end and grab this right here. All right, for the next two, it's going to be in this next room. All you're going to want to do is switch to your R2. Whoops, did not mean to press that. Hit this switch. And that will get this platform moving. You're going to have to wait for it to go there and then come back. Which will only take about a few seconds. Hop on here and I'll take you right to the first mini kit. And then the next one is the same exact thing, just on the other side of this little starting platform. Oh, I was kind of worried I jumped there way too early there. Yeah, so other side, same thing. Hit the switch. Wait for this to come back and then you can hop on and grab the last one. All right, for the final three, it's going to be in this last room for the final boss. You can see it right there. Once you do enough damage to him, he'll jump up on these little uh, platforms and all you're going to do is get your high jump character and jump up here with him and grab it. All right, this is the second to last one. He moved to this one. Jump up here, grab this. All right, and for the last one, just jump up on this last platform and grab it right there. All right, and for the mini kit build, here it is. All right, well, there you have it. That'll do for this episode. If you liked it or found it helpful at all, please feel free to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching.